One of the most common and substantial surcharges for all FedEx and UPS shippers is the residential surcharge. So a shipper really must consider the impact and truly compare FedEx and UPS applications during contract negotiations. This consideration includes much more than just the discounts offered. So today we're going to look at a few key consideration areas with residential surcharge and your overall contract negotiation strategy. So there are different prices for the residential surcharge for FedEx and UPS. The first residential contract negotiation consideration look at is going to be the price. In 2021, FedEx and UPS do not charge the same price for residential surcharges. UPS is 10 cents more expensive for ground residential surcharges. 5 cents more expensive for international and domestic express package delivery. In 2021, the prices for the residential surcharge are as follows. FedEx home delivery is going to be $4.35. UPS ground is going to be $4.45. FedEx ground is $4.80. FedEx Express domestic, $4.95. U.S. Express Domestic is now $5. FedEx International is $4.95. UPS Express International is $5. So FedEx defines a residential surcharge as a residential delivery charge that applies to shipments addressed to a home or private residence. Remember, this includes locations where business is operated from a home or any shipment in which the shipper designates the delivery address as a residence. So there's issues with FedEx ground to residences. So whenever you're doing a contract negotiation, consider there's a penalty applied when a FedEx shipper uses FedEx ground to a residential address. Home delivery is the service that a, a shipper needs to use when sending to a residence. Ground is the service to use when shipping to a commercial location. But when a ground is delivered to a residential location, the residential surcharge is going to be $4.80. So the published rate is $0.45 cents more expensive if you mistakenly use FedEx ground rather than home delivery to ship to a residential location. Most discounts for residential charges on a FedEx agreement only apply to FedEx home delivery. The discount does not apply to a residential charge on a FedEx ground package. When a FedEx home delivery residential fee is set with a 50% discount, but a shipper mistakenly uses FedEx ground, the shipper is going to see a charge of 221% more for that residential surcharge. So as you're strategizing to start to think about the type of discount you're going to pursue in a residential surcharge negotiation, you know, you need to think, would you rather take a discount as a percent off the published rate or a discount as a set dollar amount? Remember, each year, the price of the residential surcharge is going to go up. You know, they've consistently gone up since they started. Shippers, though, can negotiate a discount of anywhere from 25, 50, up to 75. We've even seen 90% discounts off the published rate for the residential surcharge. But some contracts have discounts as a flat fee and especially in UPS agreements and it's just gonna be a flat dollar amount off that residential surcharge. In my opinion this isn't the best option because each year the residential fee is going to you know it's gonna rise but that flat fee is gonna produce a lower net discount year after year. So during a contract negotiation residential surcharge is very important. Remember, each part of your FedEx and UPS agreement is negotiable. But having a strategy that's backed up by data from your shipping spend is really vital to success. You need to know what services you're using, what surcharges you're using. If access to this data is missing, contact Refund and Tree for help. The cost of transportation impacts your bottom line. To lower your shipping costs today, contact Refund and Retriever at 800 441 8085 or visit our website, refundretriever.com. Thanks a lot.